Hey guys, welcome back to The Lethal Wife. My name is Shay, and in today's video, we're gonna be doing our cash stuffing for July 2nd paycheck. Before we begin, if you are already a part of The Lethal Fam, hey sis, how you doing? And if you are new to my channel, and cash stuffing, saving funds, and challenges or things that interest you, please make sure you subscribe down below. I post videos every Wednesday and Sunday. Before we begin, you guys, two things. Um, one, excuse my voice. As always, it sounds crazy, but this time it's something a little different, y'all. I don't know what this is. All I did was eat a Reese's peanut butter, and all of a sudden my voice is like gone, throat hurting, I'm in coughing. I don't know, it's acting like I'm allergic, but I'm not allergic to Reese's, so it don't add up. But yeah, so heads up for that. Second thing, the washer and dryer are going, so I apologize in advance if you hear that. But you know, life still has to go on. We're on a trip, so I have to record this video now. So I apologize for all that in advance. And there will probably be some cuts because of me coughing and stuff like that. So bear with me, you guys. All right, you guys, so we're going to go ahead and get into this video. Today, we're going to be stuffing. Y'all, I actually don't even know. <laughs> I don't know how much we're stuffing. Um, 369 plus 112. It's gonna be a small paycheck stuffing. That's one. That's eight. It's four. We're stuffing 481 dollars. That's how much we're stuffing, you guys. So this will be a small cash stuffing. The reason being, my husband's check was a little less than it is normally. Well, I won't say normally, cause with my husband's checks, his checks kind of like he'll have like one, like one or two really good checks, and he'll kind of have that one that's kind of like eh, you know. So. This is one of the ant ones, and of course, you know, it's one of the weeks where we acting like we got friends and a whole bunch of stuff to do this week. <laughs> so, let me put that back. No, I don't like that. But yeah. So, of course, this is the week where we had a whole bunch of, where we decided to be, like, real interactive with people. <laughs> because you guys normally were homebodies, and that was pre-COVID, you know? We had our days where we go out, but that's about it. So, yeah, so we're stuffing... I already forgot how much I said, but if you forgot it, just rewind 10 seconds because I just said it. <laughs> That's bad that I forgot that fast. But anyways, you guys, if you are new and you don't follow me on Instagram, make sure that you follow me on my Instagram. I'll have it linked down here. It's at lethal, at lethal wife. I had to change it, you guys, so it's messing me up. But if you are subscribed to my Instagram, then you know that I got the official conscious wallet. Okay, your girl is excited about it. And y'all know I already made me some envelopes. Don't play with me. Don't play with me, okay? Don't do it. Don't do it. But anyways, I probably shouldn't have this out this way. But y'all, it's just a gift card. But anyways, um, yeah, so we're going to start with our cash envelopes. You guys, I am so proud of myself. Let me tell you guys why. Y'all know one of my main, like, my main challenges for, like, the next few months is to have money left over in my spending money, so not spend everything. And you guys, all last week and all this week, I have not bought any food out. Like, can I get a pat on my back? Air pat, air pat. Y'all give me a pat. Don't play with me, okay? I didn't eat out not one time last week. Well, no, let me take that back. I didn't pay to eat out not one time last week. My husband bought us breakfast one morning, but he bought that. And then yesterday at work, my manager treated us to Chick-fil-A, but she paid for that. So I haven't really had to come out of pocket for that. So I think I'm really proud of myself, you guys. Like we have 20, 30, $45. Like I literally didn't spend any of my spending money. And that's crazy. Like y'all know I'm quick for that. Like I'm good for spending all my money, like dollar to the dollar. So this money is actually going to be staying in my envelope. The 40 is because you guys know like my birthday's coming up in August and we got that trip. So y'all know that I'm trying to divvy up the amount that I'm going to spend on my nails and toes. <clears throat> just so that it's not as much coming out on that specific check. So this 40 will definitely go in there and then I'll probably put this 5 in my savings challenge. But I'm just going to put that to the side. And wifey i'm gonna go ahead oh you guys so let me cover this up a little bit because you know people out there do fraud but anyways you guys my husband and i both got a hundred dollar gift card <clears throat> let me tell y'all why so my aunt we had a big family event like we always do and we did a cornhole tournament and my husband and i actually won you guys like yes so we both got a hundred dollars each so even with this, you guys, I didn't spend any money eating out. The money that I did spend on this card was from, actually, let me take this out and move it because once I flip it over, you'll be able to see the card number. But um, I spent that money on getting a couple pairs of sh couple shirts because y'all know I'm trying to like build my wardrobe up because like I said, I'm always giving away my clothes. So 
I bought some shirts and stuff. But yeah. Y'all, I feel like I'm talking too much. I haven't even stuffed one envelope. Okay, let me just go ahead. Groceries is empty. Delight. Delight has $20 left over, but I'm rolling this over because we're doing a lot this weekend. <clears throat> We're going to South Carolina to visit my husband's brother, and we're also going to Dave & Buster's tomorrow with my best friend and her boyfriend, so I'm going to keep that money in there. Rather have too much than not enough, you know? And then next time, of course, I'll take the money out. Give has one, two, three, four, five. So I did give out five dollars, but I didn't give this five dollars out. So what I'm going to do is, because Give is supposed to get ten dollars, because I had to cut that down because as you guys can see I wasn't able to stuff that much so this is five dollars I'm just gonna leave that in there and take five out of here so one two three four five so this is just me moving my five over I'm gonna end up putting this in the one dollar challenge and then I also need to take five dollars out for my husband so one two three four five so I'm gonna move this money over to the right that'll be my husband's give money we'll both do five this paycheck because y'all, if the check is lower, we gotta cut places, you know? And I mean, it's always good that as long as you give, you know, with the right intentions, that's all that really matters. And we can't always do that, you know? So we still had $5 in miscellaneous, so I'm gonna leave that in there and I'm gonna move this to the side. Y'all, wait till we count this. Like, your girl has some savings, okay? And then this is just saving challenge, fetch rewards, and bank. Um, oh yeah, by the way, I will be linking my fetch rewards down below. So if you're not already a part of the fetch community, you can go ahead and use my referral code and you'll get 2,000 points. You guys, I'm trying to get on this bandwagon of scanning all my receipts and you guys, they were really adding up quickly. Like, I've made a lot of Amazon purchases and just the grocery purchases I'm getting points for. So I'm going to try and use those to get some gift cards. So, yeah. <clears throat> Um, so what I did, you guys, I'm trying to do better with, like, my saving money challenge. So what I started doing was, so you know I like to split my spending money up into two weeks. So what I do is I move the money after the week is over. I move it into this little thing, and this is kind of like my extra money. But now I'm going to be using my saving challenges. That's where I'll put my fives and ones after I get them. That way it's out of sight, out of mind. But this is also money that we had left over. My husband had a couple ones that I got from him, so yeah. So this is all the money that we had left over, you guys. Like, can you say, like, proud? Like, let's see how much we have. <clears throat> we had 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72. So this is 72 dollars, you guys. <clears throat> Minus the 40 that's gonna go back in my wallet. I mean, that's gonna go in my cash envelope, not in here. But yeah, I'm so proud of us. I'm gonna put this in the back, cause you know, if y'all want to see me stuff that, you know, you got to make sure you check out my challenge stuffing. That's where I stuff that. But I'm still going to keep this in here because I like to separate the money. But anyways, so for me, I'm getting $60. So I'm getting two 20s and two 10s. So I'm going to try and keep from using smaller denominations. That way I can get the fives and ones and use that towards my saving challenges. So yeah, 20, 40, 50, 60. All right, and then for groceries, now we're getting 64. I think I did a 50 for that. If not, we'll find out later. One, two, three, four. So we've got, <laughs> that's how it happens. So groceries has 64, 50, 60, one, two, three, four. I actually budgeted 100. As you can see, I crossed it out. I crossed that out because I did end up doing the Green Chef. We're gonna try that out. And that was $36. If you follow me on Instagram, then you already know that I was debating whether to try something out like that, like a healthy meal delivery service. So we're gonna try that out. Delight, Delight is getting 180, so we're getting 100, a 20, 100, 120, four tens, one, two, three, four, three fives, one, two, three, and five ones. So this should be 180. So we have 100, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80. So that's 180 plus this 200 that we, I mean, plus the 20 that we have in here. So that's 200 in delight. 
hopefully we don't spend all that because I'm not trying to and then we can save it <laughs> and then give we already stuffed miscellaneous we already stuffed and then that's it for in here oh my goodness you guys so I've been forgetting to show you guys my change I'm gonna show y'all in my saving challenges video but y'all we saved a lot of change this week so if y'all want to see how my change challenges <laughs> If y'all want to see how my my chain my coin challenges are going, make sure you check out my challenge stuffing video. That'll literally come out after this video. But that's it for my cash envelopes. And now to the sinking funds. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this. Y'all, I'm tripping. I'm gonna take out the 50 for hubby, but I'm putting it in here. But anyways, this is my $40 that I had left over from the last paycheck. I'm just gonna keep it in here because I don't like to keep all that cash on me. By the way, for the cash wallet, I don't keep all those with me. I only take what I need at the moment just because, you know, don't nobody want to carry all that cash. And hubby's getting 50, so he's getting two 20s and a 10. So that's 50. And then car maintenance. Car maintenance is getting $17. Y'all, here they go writing on these bills again. We had a whole discussion about this in the last video. I'm going to erase that in a second. Oh my goodness. I said nobody answered my question as to why people write on these. Why do they do this? They mess us up. But anyways, car maintenance now has 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 35, 36, 37. Oh yeah, my husband owe me $3 on car maintenance. So that'll make it even. Y'all, I forgot that fast what it was. 2, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 35, 36, 37. So that'll make it an even 240 when he gives me the three dollars. Let me update on my tracker. Y'all I feel like I'm always forgetting to write on here. Okay, so we got 340 in there. Toiletries, toiletries is getting four dollars. One, two, three, four. So, toiletries now has 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. So, we have $40 in toiletries. <laughs> Don't be hating. And then, health. Health is getting $13. Alright, so health now has 100, 250, 60, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80. So we got 280 in health. And then stockpile is getting 10. So stockpile has 150, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90. Y'all, I was really hurt because I really wanted to be able to stuff more so that I could hurry up and knock these last three out. That's for like when when we move in the beginning of the year, you know, go to Costco, stock up on like corn and stuff like that. Yeah. So stock file has 190. But yes, that's it for this binder. Oh my goodness, you guys, I forgot to mark this out. But anyways, we're stuffing $40 in travels. I had to cross this out after the video, I forgot. But travels getting 40. So 220s for travel. I'm a little hurt that this check was kind of small, y'all. I really wanted to kind of like knock out some of this stuff. And like those top five that I did, one, two, three, four. Yeah, these first four are really, really important. And I'm really trying to make sure by the end of the year, we at least reach my immediate goals. So like for car maintenance, that's 500. Um, toiletries is 100. Health is five. 500 is my immediate, but 1,000 is like my next goal after that. And then stockpile is 300. And then after that'll be 500. But yeah. So travel now has 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. How much? Did I say 355? Yeah. 1, 2, 3, 20, 40, 51, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yeah. So we have 355 in travel. <coughs> and then YouTube is not getting stuffed. Ooh, I hate when the money go all crazy, y'all. YouTube isn't getting stuff, but we can still count and see how much is in here. 
so a couple of them aren't getting stuff because you know this is a lower paycheck so i kind of did the necessities are the ones that i really feel like need to be stuff so youtube has 10 11 12 13 dollars entertainment entertainment is getting five so entertainment now has five six seven eight nine ten so we got ten dollars in entertainment hopefully the girls won't try and come over anytime soon because i have to build this back up it was ten right i feel like it wasn't yeah i'm tripping it oh, i'm tripping but yeah, I gotta hurry and build this back up for the girls come over because y'all know we gotta be active. We like to do stuff. Wardrobe. Wardrobe isn't getting stuff, but wardrobe has $16. We spent some of this getting my husband some work shorts. So that cut into it a little bit. Gifts. Gifts is getting $15, so it's getting a 10 and a 5. I really don't want to put that raggedy 5 in there. You guys know we have three birthdays coming in june so i mean not june we have three birthdays coming up in july so <clears throat> we gotta kind of save up for that not exactly sure where we're getting everybody i know where we're getting my brother-in-law um i don't know about my mother-in-law yet and then one of my best friends birthday is also in july so i'm not sure what what i'm getting some of them so that's kind of the hard part about it but gifts has 20 40 50 55 60 65 dollars so I'm really gonna try and like really stuff this up in the next paycheck because <clears throat> how much I'm not gonna show I keep forgetting 65 but I really have to like stuff this up with the next check because all of their birthdays are between the second and third checks so all right Black Friday also isn't getting stuffed it has 100 200 300 354 20 35 so we have 435 and Black Friday. Y'all, don't be mad that I did go back to having three binders. <laughs> but it's still better than having four, because y'all know before I have four binders. So that still means that I have a lot less sinking funds. And the only reason why I have four by I mean three binders is because these envelopes take up more space than these. I could fit more of these in a binder. These I can't fit it that many without it already being full so that's why I spread it out to three <clears throat> apartment isn't getting stuff but apartment has 50 65 75 so we have 75 in apartment I'm really hurt we couldn't stuff this one or debt I really wanted to but hey we gotta make it do what it do debt just has a hundred car insurance so I did bring this envelope back the reason being <clears throat> As you guys all know, I told you guys that my dad and I rotate paying the car insurance every year. And um, we just recently switched our plan. We're, we switched to Progressive. And Progressive offers you a discount if you pay it in full, the full like, um, six months policy. So my dad is paying this year because this is his turn. And then next year, me and my husband are going to pay. So I'm going to start saving up for that premium that will owe in January. Or it's almost going to be February. But yeah, so I have to start saving for that to make sure that we're able to pay it in bulk. That way we get the savings because the savings is almost one month's full free payment. So definitely down for that. Anniversary is getting five. So anniversary has 20, 40, 45, 50. I also brought this one back just because for our anniversary, we probably won't be doing much. And our anniversary is coming up. I mean, it's in January. So dang. But yeah, our anniversary is in January, so I don't want to be forgetting about it at the last minute. <laughs> so I'd rather just do a couple dollars every paycheck because we're not going to spend that much. Like, I think the goal is just $150 for anniversary. And then Mother's Day, I brought Mother's Day and Father's Day back just because I didn't want to have to forget about them. You know, so Mother's Day is 7. Plus, I figured me have, I should have this one out now. That way, I don't have to stuff as much every paycheck. I can, you know stuff a couple dollars every paycheck and by the time it's made we'll definitely have enough in there i'm thinking about getting my mother-in-law a purse for her birthday um we used to do give my mom a purse every year when she was here so his mom my husband's mom is very sweet you guys she's like one of those people that never asks for anything and she doesn't really like buy stuff like that so i really want to do that for her 
but um father's day father's day is just getting a dollar let me erase this this nasty one y'all all right so father's day has six i don't know what we'll get my father and my father-in-law for father's day next year but we have a lot of time honestly my father-in-law is hard to get for because as soon as he says he wants something y'all he goes and gets it he don't be playing okay all right so that is it for this cash stuffing if you enjoyed this video please make sure you give me a like and a thumbs up and comment down below and i will see you guys in the next video bye